Yeah, I actually got an early viewing, so I was, would be prepared for the panel. And they portrayed autism perfectly. I mean, like, I was watching, I'm like, are they sure Claire Danes isn't Aspie as well? I mean, because every other movie iteration of Asperger's, it's either been Rain Man sort of thing, or it's been this person isn't at all autistic. And this is perfect. First of all, it portrays autism perfectly. I mean, a lot of times I would find where that while Claire Danes' character, Temple Grandin, was about to, you know, have a meltdown because of a bad social situation or something, I was right there with, with her, you know, ready to freak out over the problem. And then, you know, little takes like running fingers through her hair or something. That's something I do almost every day, you know, stay calm sort of thing. So it, it's not just the fact that it portrays autism perfectly or that it shows the way how we think differently perfectly. It's that you relate to it perfectly. And besides the running the fingers through the hair, is there anything in particular that you relate to? Um, well, she invented a squeeze machine at one point based off of something they used on cattle. Mm -hmm. And I remember at one point, we were on a motorcycle trip and we were staying in a rented camper and my bed was like a mattress on a raised area that was hanging over the ground instead of you know, over a different part of the bus. Yeah. And then you know I could zip it, zip shut these curtains and that made it feel like perfectly cut off from the rest of the world and I probably got the same feeling she got in the squeeze machine. It was it was cool. Very cool. Well tell us what it's like to be here. Is it exciting? Well, What's going through your head? well meeting Temple Grandin is amazing. She's such an important or such a amazing person in the fact that she's achieved so much and I'm not gonna say despite because that's one of the big things I'm against. You know I don't suffer from autism. She obviously doesn't suffer from autism. It's it's been the highlight of like the month or the year. That's good. Or the decade. <laughs> We've got some time in front of you. Hopefully many more good things will happen too. I hope so too. Well thank you very much for talking to us. You're welcome.